Hi, Future Talk here. I just wanted to let you guys know there's some like serious mic issues this episode. There's a lot of mic crackling and I can see if it gets really frustrating to some people. Feel free to like skip the episode. Um, I am trying to figure out how to fix it. <laughs> so sorry. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the episode. Bye. Hi, and welcome back to another video. Um, today I wasn't actually planning on doing another Meet the Hodges video, but I was playing them a little bit off camera and some stuff developed and I kind of wanted to like just jump back into the game because I'm like really intrigued to see where it goes. Um, so first things first, um, he's feeling pretty sad. Um, Janae, our next door neighbor and one of our few friends, um, she passed away. I, I don't know why. I don't know how. Um, but yeah, so she died. Um, <laughs> and then, um, his, uh, other person that he met a couple episodes, Ritvik died also. So that's a thing. The moldy cakes from the last video are still here. And then exciting, very exciting news. I was playing with Callie. And she actually met some of the sims that I put in the world, Bridget and her twin Johnny. And um, she actually has her first crush. So I'm, I'm so happy about this because I love Johnny a lot. And so <laughs> when I found out she had a crush on him, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so exciting. So she finally has her first crush. And it's on one of the sims that I made, and she got a crush on him almost immediately. I also was, like, kind of hoping she'd get one on Bridget, too, because I love Bridget a lot as well, but super exciting news. Um, <laughs> I just had wanted to, like, take a day or so to, like, work on their skills and stuff, but, um, yeah, I wasn't expecting all that to happen within one day off camera. I would hope you like painting, but we're going to spend the day with, um, our boy Eric here. Let's clean up these gross cakes. Also, I, as part of his, um, like trying to like change himself and like work on himself, I started having him go jogging in the morning, but he lost weight at such a rapid pace. Like almost a little too fast um so that that was I don't know I wanted him to work on himself but I wasn't expecting him to just lose all of his weight like immediately so that was a little bit disappointing um but he's looking really good like he's looking really hench <laughs> his butt is still absolutely massive I don't think that that thing's going down don't you have school oh you're gonna play football with your dad? That's so cute. Stop. Stop. You have to go to school soon, though. So, we're not gonna have difficult football practice. Go pee. I swear. Sims don't take care of themselves. Why are you washing dishes in there? Your daughter has to go to the bathroom before she goes to school. Um, I don't really know. I'm gonna send her alone. I wanna spend the day with Eric today. Um, I'm not too sure what I want him to do today. He's pretty sad about um Janae so thanks mom uh I don't know we have to uh send his book in that he wrote in the last one so let's do that It doesn't meet their standards. Okay, so he's gonna go ahead and go edit it. I will say, yeah. Um, I'm gonna have him edit this rejected content. I didn't realize my game was paused. This is gonna bring in a lot of money, so. 
And then I think we're just gonna go out. I don't know. Um, he is not. What? Now that Callie is getting pretty good grades, some bullies have been picking on her lately. Should she confront them with a witty comeback or ignore them and hopefully they'll pick a different target? Confront them. She wouldn't. If bullies responded well. We found Callie trying to hack the school computers today. Oh. Oh my gosh. They understand. Okay. Well. It's just a rough time all around. What's going on? She got a wedgie at school? Oh my goodness. This is not is not going too well. Today the day has not started out very <laughs> very nicely. And he made a He's feeling sad about a social bunny post. Okay, well, he's not doing too hot. Um, he's, oh gosh, I feel so bad for him. I think we're gonna go out to try to cheer him up a little bit today though. Oh, maybe we can go shopping or something. I don't know, a little retail therapy always helps. You can't. All right, well, because he has this outfit, and then he has his other outfit that is also just like, I don't think I've he's ever walked around in this one, but it is very um, comfy core. <laughs> but I think we're going to go out today. Um, hopefully meet some people for him so he can make some friends. Um, or I have an even better idea. All right, so um, Eric decided to take Marcel out um, just to grab like something to eat um, since Janae isn't here anymore and I think he just kind of wants to help his friend out. Um, oh, they're here with their whole family. So we're going to hope and cross our fingers that the chefs actually cook now because they were not cooking. Apparently it was a bug. Um, so we're going to hope that this actually works. Is this our table? All right, so let's order some food. Let's sit together and order some food. Um, he's already gone. I love the idea of being able to go to a restaurant and get food with my friend, but I don't like that it's not working. <laughs> Let's get them both a whiskey sour since we can't order beer for the table. Um, and then maybe a steak. And then I think he'll get some grilled chicken. And we'll see if it even comes to the table because it hasn't been working. I kind of wanted them to just sit together and talk. Alright, so we just got a text from May, one of the only per people that he's actually somewhat flirted with, asking if she should go on a date with someone else. Um, I'm just gonna say yes, like good for her, but that definitely doesn't feel good on his pride. Um, <laughs> I think he definitely like wanted to... She's He's dead. But... Maybe, maybe she killed him, maybe. Ooh, the drama. Um, no, not really, but I'm like waiting for my food still. That better be mine. Is that mine? At least the chefs are actually cooking. When we went to the diner, no one was serving us. Is that mine? That's still not mine. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my gosh, Callie's an A student? Oh, that is awesome. I'm so proud of her. 
Oh my gosh. That's freaking amazing. Please sit down. Is that ours? Holy crap. It is so loud here. He doesn't like steak, apparently. What's being prevented from being or like delivered to our table? Everything's here. So we're just gonna have this drink and then go home. Um, and I think he's gonna have a little like celebration for Callie for getting an A. I think he just needs kind of a break from all of this craziness. He's just really sad right now. Not like literally nothing is going his way and I feel so bad for him. If you're not, I'm taking it. I'm paying for it, so. Okay, you're gonna eat it? Okay. Since you're eating it, I'm not gonna. Oh. 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 <laughs> ah! I thought. I thought he wasn't gonna eat it, so I stole it. <laughs> I didn't mean to take it from him while he was mid meal. I mean, I did it. It was my fault. I did. I just thought he wasn't gonna eat it, so I took it. But all right, let's send in that book to see if it got approved. It still doesn't meet the quality standards. Well, I was. I wanted him to do something with um, Callie tonight, but I'm gonna have him go and work on the book some more. She's not feeling the greatest after school anyway, since she got bullied today. What the hell is going on? Man? She works today, so I think I'm actually going to have her work on her homework. And then once you're done editing that, if you could come and repair this. Oh, Jeb is here. Hey, Jeb. You got a gift for me, homie? Hopefully she finishes her homework in time. the heck now we have to call we have to hire a repair service because i don't want him getting electrocuted did you invite jeb in oh no he left invite jeb in never mind sorry <laughs> all right what's her work from home assignment today update online bio with business headshot oh that's easy enough It got rejected again. Oh, he didn't get to finish repairing it. Bro. What? Oh, it's because the door was locked. Oh, that's so annoying. We'll have to hire it and work on it tomorrow. Or, I mean, we'll still have it be repaired, but... Let's come change our outfit and update our business headshot again. Uh, take a selfie. Cute. 
I always take five because I never know. Not May being here. Okay, what are you doing? Are you dancing? Of course you're dancing. Um. Oh, it's At Last. I love this song. Watch a movie with um. Callie. Are you watching it? No. <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> All right, I guess we're going to bed. Not her going to sleep with metal on in her room. So we're back the next day. We are with Callie today. Um, it is her date. So we are just going to take the day with her. Um, I don't know if there's any events going on at school today. Oh no, there's one going on tomorrow. I kind of wanted to go to career day with her, but I want to make sure to spend time with um, Eric too. Ugh, shoot. Hmm. Well, we'll stay with her. Um... Yeah, we'll stay with her for today, and we'll just do the career thing another day. We do have nine days until she ages up. I extended her um, aging, so she has more time. I'm trying to see who all is here today. I wanted to see if Johnny was here, but he does not appear to be here, which stinks because I wanted her to interact with her crush. I don't know why she's starting a painting. It's not like she has time. Also, I cannot believe that she's being bullied at school. I can't imagine who... I mean, maybe Malcolm, but... Malcolm at least likes her a little bit. Maybe Wolfgang? He was getting in a fight the other day. I don't know, maybe we'll have her have a little conflict with Wolf Wolfgang today. Spice it up, you know? But for now, she's just having a good time in class and about to hang out with Molly, I guess. I don't know why she's always trying to play football with Rita. It's weird. Oh, there's exam prep today. She might attend exam prep. But for now, she's just going to attend class. I don't know. She might skip exam prep. It did say that she prepped for the exams enough last week. So. Kyoshi's in school today. So after um, Callie got like bullied yesterday, I think she's kind of like gonna stick up for herself a little bit and she's gonna like come for Wolfgang a little bit. She's pretty mad about him giving her a wedgie yesterday. So she's gonna insult him a little bit and she's like, you're a waste of space. Like I can't believe that you bullied me yesterday just because I have better like grades than you. So. I want her to make some enemies, you know? And she's stretching right now. <laughs> kind of ruins the vibe I was trying to start, but... What are you sad about, huh? Huh? She's gonna mock his sadness. Saved by the bell. I was gonna bully him back. Like, no. Do I know for sure that it was Wolfgang that was bullying her? No. But, I mean, there's not a lot of options here. So, we're gonna pick on him. <laughs> I'll 
Also, she needs some enemies at school, you know? All right, so it's after school and Callie decided to come out to the boba place with all of her friends. Um, she's already feeling super flirtatious because Johnny is here. So I want her to like go over and like compliment him a little bit, put a little bit of flirting in, you know? Um, oh, and he liked it. Ah, that's cute. Um, but I don't know, I kind of want to see where it goes with these two. Also, I want to be able to complete this before she ages up, so she has to mess around in the cuddle carts. So we have to <laughs> kind of progress this relationship a little bit. Reveal crush. Ooh, she can do that? Is he leaving me? Well, in any case, all of the front and her mom, dude, I swear her mom has like a tracker on her or something because her mom is always. Is comedy night going on upstairs? Where's comedy night going on? curious when comedy night goes on does the boba shop not function as a boba place it's not this random adult trying to hang out with the kids i like that she's like side eyeing her <laughs> gossip to bridget Alright, and with that, that should be done. And then, what I wanted to do next. <gasps> the drama. She has a crush on Bridget, too. on both of the twins. <laughs> Callie! They're twins and like good friends at that. Like, oh my goodness. I don't know what to do now. Oh my gosh, that's so awkward. That is so awkward. I don't even know what to do with that. I'm gonna go upstairs and create a fashion look, but I... <laughs> I can't believe she has a crush on both of them. What are we gonna do? Should we create drama and mess around with both of them? But then one of them's gonna get hurt. Or both of them are gonna get hurt. I don't know what to do. I guess I could see which one gets a crush on her first, but sometimes even that's a little bit... Oh my goodness. I can't believe this. <laughs> so I wanted to give this whole, like, outfit thing a try. Um, oh my gosh, the music in here is so loud. Let me turn that down. Um, because I haven't really messed around with this very much. Like, I kind of did with Cadence, but I don't know. I just want to try making an outfit and seeing if we can sell it. This is so cute. I have to use this. <laughs> I have to. I'm a little sad that, like, there's no custom content in here, though, because I would have really liked to use my custom content pants. Um, what shoes? These ones, maybe? So, this is gonna be our outfit. Um, we're gonna name it Froggy Chic. <laughs> I love this outfit, that's so cute. I love the froggy shirt. 
so I'm excited to use it. What is up with her and doing comedy routines? That no one's watching, by the way. No one's out here. It's just her talking to herself. I mean, go off, I guess, sis. <sighs> it's so awkward, though. Try on your outfit. <gasps> That's so cute! I want you to go show it off. Um, well, since you have two crushes now, you can go show it off to both of them, I guess. Like, oh, look what, how cute I look. I can't believe she has a crush on both of them, though. Does she have work tonight? No. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do next... We're gonna go with the crew and go ride some rides together and see what happens in the love tunnel. All right, so I set it up. They're all here to hang out. Um, and let's cross our fingers that she can actually go into the romance ride with Johnny. I am also going to try it with Bridget and see what happens. So we'll see. She's not as close with Bridget though. So I don't know how that's gonna go. They kind of got into a spat right before they left too, so. I'm a little bit on the edge about that one. <laughs> I don't know how well that's gonna go, but we'll see. Turl de Lerve. The stars have aligned and Callie takes her crush on the cuddle carts where all good relationships begin. The lighting, the music, the employee awkwardly standing in the corner changing a light bulb, everything the beginning of a budding romance needs. The time has come. Does Callie take the first step and attempt to start some romance or does she take it easy and keep it casual? Romance. The cuddle carts have done it once again. Johnny seems to catch on to her vibe and scoots a little closer. Callie tries to hold back the excited squeal and casually puts her arm around Johnny. Oh, that's so cute. This really is a cuddly cart. The employee in the corner gives a thumbs up with a nod of approval before screwing in the final light bulb. Things are looking bright for these two. Oh, that's so cute. I'm, I like I can handle most things but fluffy stuff like that absolutely just ruins me that is so cute oh my god I'm so glad it went well these two are just standing here <laughs> Oh my gosh. He's gonna go talk to his sister. He's probably telling her what happened in there. I'm so happy right now. She's feeling so flirty from that too. Oh, I'm so happy for her. Oh no, you don't have to stop eating to go. Where did you put that? No, oh, don't be embarrassed. He's dazed. I wonder what he's dazed from. <gasps> he didn't like that. Okay, well, let's not go too fast, I guess. <laughs> I think with that, uh, we're going to go home because that was really awkward and I thought that was going to go well, but it did not. So, I think it might have been because she was already super embarrassed, so it just didn't go that well. Um, he's also dazed, so I don't think he's feeling the greatest either, but we're just going to kind of run home after that awkward encounter of being rejected after revealing our crush, after just cuddling in the cuddle carts. 
Yes, Dad, we're about to be home in a second. All right, we're back home after that horribly awful moment. Um, we're gonna go get some leftovers. Um, and her dad is gonna hire a repair service. Holy hench, man. Because our sink is broken and our computer is broken. We need some help in here. They'll arrive at 12? Okay. Yeah, go eat. <laughs> no, this is what you call a table of two people that are having a hard time romantically. <laughs> Oh gosh, it's not working out for either of them. Oh, at least they have each other though. He's sad about being rejected and having his friend die. She's upset because, well, she went on a ride with her crush. We're gonna have her come and take a shower and maybe mop in the bathroom since it's a mess. Um, and I think with that absolute embarrassing um, moment, uh, we're gonna wrap up the episode here. Um, another two days uh, gone through and uh, it, it, was, it was a time. I mean, we got some romantic progress, but not a whole lot. Um, kind of just... <laughs> romantic failure if anything else but thank you so much for watching and i'm hoping things go a little bit better in the next episode and i'll talk to you guys later bye